Yeah. Samantha Bee apologizes for using slur. The White House condemns the monologue of the presenter and asks TBS to publicly repudiate it. Comedian Samantha Bee, famous for her sour sense of humor, called on Wednesday in her full frontal program Feckless Cunt to Ivanka Trump for not doing anything against the separation of families on the border between United States and Mexico. The White House called the comment violent cruel and asked the television network to publicly show its rejection of the monologue. After that be apologized, I crossed a line. The comments come days after the Roseanne Barr series was abruptly cancelled by ABC due to a racist tweet that the actress published about the former employee of the Obama administration, Valerie Jarrett. The controversial photo of Ivanka Trump embracing her son Theodore is still giving something to talk about. This time, to say that it was not so much. With the background image, Samantha Bee asked the businesswoman to talk to Donald Trump. Put on something tight and low cut and do something about your dad's immigration policy, you feckless cunt. As expected, the White House press secretary, Sarah Huckabee Sanders, was much more critical of Bee's comments than those of the former ABC star. The collective silence of the left and its allied means is appalling, their unpleasant comments, from Bee, and the program are not apt to be broadcast and Time Warner and TBS executives must show that such explicit blasphemy of women this administration will not be tolerated, Sanders accused. However, about the racist tweet was more terse and called it inappropriate. She then said ABC also owes an apology to the White House for the derogatory comments they have made about the staff. Shortly after the press secretary statements, B apologized on Twitter. I would like to sincerely apologize to Ivanka Trump and my viewers for using an expletive in my program to describe it last night, it was inappropriate and inexcusable, I crossed a line and I deeply regret it, the comedian said. It was too late for many. Auto Trader, a sponsor of the program, withdrew because it considered offensive and unacceptable the comments of the presenter of Full Frontal. Everything seems to indicate that the repercussions will be milder than those faced by Rose and Barr. TBS already published its position on the sayings of B and, although it punishes them, it does not let glimpse anything similar to a dismissal. Samantha B has acted correctly by apologizing for the violent inappropriate language she used on Ivanka Trump last night. Those words should not have been transmitted. It was also our mistake, and we regret it the television network reported.